So first, I'm gonna weigh out 18 grams of beans for a double shot of espresso. Okay, next I'm gonna mist the beans with a little bit of water mist. There is um, some science that suggests this helps remove static when you're grinding the beans and therefore less likely to clog your machine and also improves the flavor during extraction. In they go to the grinder. Now, the thing I do um, that I just picked up from a coffee expert is I'll put a filter paper in the bottom of my basket um, just to help with an even extraction. Um, I haven't done an AB test whether there's a huge improvement on the flavor. That's just an extra step that I take. And then you've got to dial in your grind <coughs> to get the right extraction time. Um, and I've spent a considerable amount of time tweaking, including opening up the grinder and adjusting the, the, the grind head uh, to actually get it finer because um, my coffee was coming out way too fast. But I've got it dialed in here where for 18 grams of coffee, two shots, uh, I've got the right grind size where when I extract, I'm getting the optimum extraction time and therefore great quality espresso. Um, the grinder, as I've discovered and been advised, is probably more important than the coffee machine. So here we go. little filter thing on top there just helps me keep uh, keep the grinds good, uh, not falling everywhere. Okay so next thing I do is I use my own homemade WDT uh, dispensing tool um, which just helps get the coffee grinds even so you don't, don't get clumps and it also helps prevent channeling where you get these kind of little holes of water where the water isn't actually dispersing. So this is kind of a quite a geeky thing, but it does translate to better extraction. Um, and as I said, I made mine. It's just a wine cork with some sewing needles. Probably saved myself about 20 or 30 quid there. Um, so we give it a good dispersal, break up the, the clumps. Um, so all of this, what I'm doing right now, they refer to as puck prep. And, you know, the coffee geeks uh, really um, emphasize good puck prep. Um, let's just make sure that that's all even. And then um, what I do is give it a tap just to even it down into the basket. Uh, let's get rid of that ring. Even, even the grinds, just get them nice and level across the water filter. And next, I'm going to grab my tamping tool. Just get that, make sure everything stays inside. We get some of the grinds jumping out here. And then I like to tamp pretty, pretty firmly. So a lot of downward pressure and a twist. And um, just pack 
pack it in nice and tight. Just tidy up here. And um, that's, that's a pretty good coffee puck in there. It's gonna extract nicely. Um, but I picked up this other little thing called a puck screen, stainless steel puck screen. So that just lays on top. Again, it helps with the dispersing the water, preventing channeling, but it also helps keep the group head clean so you don't get too much oil and gunk sticking to the group head. So that's all ready to go. And now the fun part, uh, the extraction, um, that filter jug um, makes, uh, gives me good clean filtered water. I only use filtered water in coffee machine. Um, I have a little timer here. I have it set to 26 seconds, which is the sort of um, consensus of uh, optimum extraction time. So you have to calibrate your grind and your, your puck prep so that after 26 seconds of extraction, you have about 36 grams of coffee from 18 grams of beans. And that's your classic uh, proper double espresso. Now I'm gonna do a little pre-infusion and what that means is um, a few seconds of uh, pump, a uh, couple of seconds of pause and then resume. And it just helps to infuse uh, the puck before you fully then extract. So here we go. So I'm gonna do five seconds of uh, pre-infuse, three seconds of pause and then resume. Here we go. tell by looking that's a little more than 36 grams it's probably probably around 40 maybe 45 gram uh, so that would be more of a long go but nevertheless we've got a good extraction a good amount of time uh, the right kind of dosing there uh, for a decent espresso